OP2403157. A warning order issued by the intelligence staff of Chernerus First Army Corps warned of a new separatist operation to take over the town of Zishevich in Sumava. A task force was assembled from elements of 1st Battalion, Chernerus 9th Separate Light Rifle Brigade, and marched on Zishevich. The task force consisted of four truck-borne light rifle squads, two mechanized cavalry recon squads riding aboard T-34 tanks, and two BRDM scout cars. The recon squads encountered an enemy foot patrol about halfway to the objective, but the enemy patrol was driven off. Zishevich is bisected by a small river which is connected by three bridges, two motor bridges and one railroad bridge. Additionally, two river fords are just north of the village, both usable by both vehicles and infantry. The tactical plan for defending Zishevich was for 1st Recon Squad to take a position at the southern edge of the village overlooking the river to the north, while 2nd Squad covered the railroad bridge and one of the motor bridges, as 3rd Squad covered the northeastern edge of the village. 4th Squad was held in reserve at the southern edge of the village. Command squad with one of the T-34s took up a position on the other motor bridge. Russian militia and Wagner operators attempted to cross the two motor bridges, but were driven back by rifle fire. More attacks by separatists and affiliated forces came across one of the fords. Those were driven back as well. As new attacks came from the northwest and from the north, Casualties by 2nd Squad began to mount, and after only a few minutes became so severe, Commander ordered 2nd Squad to retreat. 4th Squad was ordered to replace 2nd Squad, but they became bogged down by enemy attacks. Recon Squad 2 had been covering the flanks of 2nd Squad, and they held their positions even though some enemy infiltrators managed to slip through. According to reports on the ground at the time, enemy vehicles were having an incredibly difficult time in crossing either at the bridges or the fords, many of them bogging down. Even so, the two T-34 tanks which provided some anti-armor capability had difficulties in locating and destroying the enemy armor. This left our rifle squads with their light anti-tank means to destroy enemy armor. At this point, Every rifle squad in the task force had suffered heavy casualties, so the commander began to withdraw his task force. When the order from battalion command came down to retreat, most of the bridges and river crossings had been abandoned. Remnants of the task force retreated in good order from Zishevich. Casualties were heavy. Second squad lost eight, which forced commander to fold second squad into command squad. 3rd Squad lost 3, and 4th Squad lost 6. Recon Squad 1 lost 3, and Recon Squad 2 lost 4. There were no friendly vehicle losses. Field counts of enemy losses included 2 BMPAPCS, 1 BRDM scout car, 1 T-34 tank, and 2 UAVs.